What's up, you guys? Welcome back to the vlogs. Um, today was a good day. Today I woke up, um, showered, brushed my teeth, and today I had a job interview, so I'm crossing my fingers. I'm really crossing my fingers <clears throat> for this job. You know, it's just, you know, a job. You make money. Um, and today, something came in the mail. Uh, my girlfriend got me something for my birthday. Um, but <laughs> there's a lot that I want to talk about in this vlog. I just wanted to say welcome back to the vlogs. I'm on my way home right now. So, But what came in the package today is a sweater. Oh, yeah. This package came in, I mean, the package, the sweater, came into the mail today. So here I am wearing it today, brand new. <clears throat> if you guys haven't noticed, I'm, I'm a big Zelda fan, so. Yeah, man, welcome back to the vlogs. There's a lot that I want to talk about. Um, music updates and updates on my life. Um. We'll talk to you guys soon, okay? Welcome back to the vlogs. Let's get it. <laughs> so, I didn't vlog earlier after I got back home because when I got home, I wanted to take my son to the store. <clears throat> so, after that, I ended up just um, cleaning up and my girlfriend made dinner, which was amazing. Um, but yeah, man, I, I have a lot I wanted to talk to you guys about. If you can't see me, I'm sorry, it's dark out. Um, but there is, there's a lot. Like, <laughs> I told you guys in February, on February 12th <clears throat> is where my spirit was uplifted. And I just, it was amazing for me. Sorry, I'm crossing the road. It was amazing for me because I did my first solo show. So, um, and it, it turned out pretty good. I mean, I really enjoyed it. I loved the fact that, you know, kids were listening to me. Like, it was something that I used to do, okay? I always performed at, like, schools. I performed at... Um, workshops, like events where youth can be involved. <clears throat> um, it was something that was, it was, it brought back a feeling, okay, this is what I can do. So the feeling of, of now, this is, this is what I, this is what I want to do. This is what I plan to do. You know, I'm not going to be rapping forever. I'm not going to be, you know, making music all the time. Um, maybe an inspirational speaker. Um, just something to reach out to the youth. Music is always going to be the thing they remember, so... <laughs> I'm still young. Not that young, but... I can still make music and be able to reach out to... To youth who who enjoy rap, who enjoy hip hop, <clears throat> but I got to meet a lot of you know great people along the way. Also, some family members who came and you know who pretty much invited me to to this event. My uncle, my uncle was the one who got me to really. To really keep going with this um, because that day I was nervous I it's because I was by myself when I'm, like I, I, mean, I usually perform with my brother but I was by myself and it turned out like a great success I love my brother I miss performing with my brother um, but I know he's busy, so I, 
I had my first solo show on February 12th for 2016. Um, I had a I had a plan to vlog that day, but I just didn't want to vlog. I can show you a little clip. Um, I met this amazing man who knew my grandpa, my grandpa Danny Daniels the first. Um, I didn't get to record much because, you know, the youth were enjoying it and being up up there with him as he was performing. So, sorry, traffic. But I can show you a clip if you guys want. Um, I'll just play it no matter what. But his name is Ed Pikachu. Um If I pronounce that wrong, my bad. But he's an amazing guy. Um, his music is really good. So, it was... It was an amazing experience to actually perform by myself, and I pulled it off. It was difficult for me, but it was also, you know, uplifting. You guys seen the last vlog? I wanted to, I wanted to quit. Like I was, I don't know. I just really wanted to quit. But if you if you can tell now, I'm, I'm really feeling it. My um. I don't know if I'm going to turn it into an album or an EP, but um, DTA, Don't Trust Anyone, you know, most of what's been recorded right now is stuff from me and Benevolence, um, but I do have a track on the way I'm working with <clears throat> Captain Gotti, um, Smoke, and Tristan, Tristan Swain, um, it's... It's going to be a dope, a dope CD. I'm excited to get things going. Um, and after I'm done, you know, I'm going to, I'm going to see what I can do with the CD. And it doesn't matter what I'm doing with it. I have some songs that I really want to put out. <clears throat> um, some really great, you know, messages. And it's like going back to, to, to how I was feeling before. Nostalgic Rhymes was just like, okay, I'm saying F this. I don't need that type of music. Like going back to not being cold hearted, but just to the fact that I'm having fun with music. And I mean, that's, I'm still gonna be doing that. I'm gonna be making music for myself. I'm gonna be making music to reach out to people. And that's what I was worried about. You know, a lot of things have been crazy. A lot of people have been trying to... I, I, I delete people from my life. I delete people from... <laughs> oh, God, I remember this video. I, I remove people. I, I forget negativity. I don't, I don't mess with any of that anymore because... The, what I, what I've been feeling lately, music has been, music has been my medicine. <clears throat> Just listening to some beats, listening to some of my old songs, or pick, picking up old, you know, projects that weren't even finished. And I, I put up a post, you know, all the collaborations I was supposed to have. I am no longer doing with some of those artists because, you know, they've just been sitting on the shelf for too long. And it's in no disrespect. You know, I love and respect my friends. You know, excuse me. Everything that, you know, happened in Animal, you know, with some of my friends, um, you know, it's... Those were great opportunities to be a part of certain events or, you know, it was just, it was great. And lately I feel like I haven't been having any luck performing in an ammo. <clears throat> like the whole scene, like <laughs> the whole in an scene, man, is just, I don't know. Everybody's getting a lot of opportunities. I ain't sweating it though. Um, I'm getting back to what I, you know, what I was doing is performing for, for schools and youth events or anything that involves 
you know, the youth, because I used to do that. Um, but yeah, man, I just, I got a lot of new music on the way. Um, you know, I, I talked to a friend who had watched my last vlog, didn't talk to him in person, but, um, you know who you are, man, you told me to make funny songs, you told me to be creative again, you know, get the fire going, and, you know, that really, that really made me want to keep going, because I wasn't having fun anymore, like I said, when, when music is boring, when music isn't fun anymore, I feel like I'm close to just leaving it, I don't want to, I don't want to record, I don't want to write, I don't want to be anything, I don't want to do, I don't want anything to do with music because it just wasn't fun anymore, and, and if you guys are, just, you know, if you watched my vlog when I was in Vancouver, I had planned something, but I've been, I, t I was talking to, uh, to my brother, and I, w I also talked to my mom, that I wanted to become healthy again, I wanted to be, <laughs> I wanted to feel healthy and feel alive, um, but let's just say, let's say I was depressed about it, not insanely depressed, I was just more of, uh, I don't know, I don't want to deal with, deal with that, working out and running, like, it's what I used to, I, I post about it on Facebook, like, every once in a while, and my biggest problem is, is the junk, <laughs> the bad, the bad stuff, um, right now I'm supposed to be going to the store, my, I was going to the store for me and my girlfriend. <clears throat> um, but yeah, man. Like I said, a new CD, um, first rap features are, you know, VIP. You know, uh, I'm always wondering about guitar players, you know? Just how good or good picker can you use? I think it's just a good idea. Real good or rap. So my phone cut out, not cut out, pretty much died, it's on the charger, um, VIP are the first rap features, um, also Mr. John, <clears throat> all, all beats produced by him, um, yeah man, I just, I'm excited to actually have some, some new music out because, um, just having new beats, um, new song ideas, and stuff that I actually like that I'm actually putting together. So, the one I'm really excited to to put out is a song called um, Go "Going Down." It's it's just so okay. I don't want to put out too much. Um, but yeah, there's a song called Going Down, which is pretty much about, you know, losing yourself or, I don't, I don't want to say it because it's a great song, um, 
Okay, I'm only gonna tell you that much. And there's a song called um, Last Call. And most of the songs that that really have a meaning to it, I'm I'm excited to put it out because you know just putting out songs where you know you're not just gonna hear rap, you're also gonna hear singing. You know, shout out to Benevolence who's been working with us for for quite a while now. Um, but yeah. The movement is still happening. The, um, song, the, some of those songs are ready. The movement is pretty much on pause to, you know, figure things out. My brother is busy most of the time. Um, we're all busy. Pretty much all of us are busy. And I honestly, I just wanted to see if I can, you know, put out another project by myself. And just just to feel that, to feel motivated, to be able to express some things. Um, you guys heard the last vlog. I can't express the way I did before because things are are taken a lot differently nowadays, and there's a lot of things that. Things that can be said can be taken the wrong way. Um, I've had a lot of. I had a lot that I wanted to express, but you know, just taking care of my family and being able to be here for my boys and my girlfriend. Um, Joey's in front of me right now. He's jumping, but I don't. He's he's enjoying himself so. No camera on him tonight. Um, but yeah, I, I don't remember what I was going to say earlier, but just VIP. Um, VIP is the first rap features. The first rap features for the CD. Um, Mr. John is on it as well, but I'm talking about like features who, you know, someone new that we're working with. And everyone that I was supposed to work with, you know, some of the songs are recorded. Some of the songs that we have are already put together. And just waiting on other people, it's just like, okay, the songs are just going to sit. Um, and I just went through them the other night. And I'm excited to, you know, start working on them. Because they, <clears throat> excuse me, they've just been sitting there, and I really want to be able to put, you know, a CD together that involves the new addiction and new artists. He's looking at my phone. Hi, son. Hi, cool. This is what I love. This is what I enjoy right now is taking care of my boys and, you know. Spending time with them and all that type of stuff. You know, music is something that <clears throat> that music is something that I was about to repeat myself. Music is all that I knew. Music was all that was in my life. I'm not saying that I forgot it. I'm just saying <clears throat> that you know. It's hard to express things lately, and it's just difficult to be able to put out some 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 songs when you know there's certain things that you don't want to say, or you're afraid of how people are going to take it. Or but everything is great now. Everything is perfect. Everything is fine. You know, I love I love what's happening. You know, my boys are growing fast and. Everything is great, um, but this whole vlog was about, you know, feeling uplifted, so back to that, I am feeling great, I am feeling motivated, inspired, and ready to put out some more music for you guys. Um, 
that being said, welcome back to the vlogs. Um, my phone's running out of storage. Please come back, like, and subscribe. New music coming soon.